it's Monica Fabio with Cooper Sotheby's International Realty. We have a really special, beautiful show today. We are in Blanco County. It's right outside Austin, which is Bear County. And we are on the Byram Ranch. I've got Monica Byram here. Hi. Part of the family. So a little bit about ranches in general in Texas. We have about 84% of our land in Texas, which is still rural or farm. And about one in every seven person works in some agricultural role. We have about 250,000 ranches. And we also lead the country in cattle, cotton, hay, sheep, goat, mohair production. So it's a big business here, but it's also a lot of a pleasure for the families. And so Monica here is gonna tell us a little bit about what it takes to run a ranch, what's special about this ranch. It's about 2,600 acres. So tell us a little history. Well, my father-in-law, John, bought the place in the late 60s, and since then it's been a labor of love to get it to where it is now. We have about 25 different kinds of African animals that live here, and they do great in this climate and on this property. We don't have to do too much to take care of them other than put out some supplemental feed when it gets really cold, or if it's really dry conditions, we put out extra food and hay, but it's really nice to be able to have them here and enjoy them. And we have, I think about 10 or 12 people that work here full time that keep up with the dams and making sure that the animals are doing okay. And it's a lot of work that gets done behind the scenes that luckily we just get to enjoy the, the fruits of. So a lot of the ranches here have runways, the best and easiest way to get to the ranches. Another thing about ranches in Texas, about 98.6 of them are family owned or it's a family partnership. So once people get their hands on this beautiful property, they just keep it in the family as much as possible. A lot of them get split up because of estate taxes when they're sold and that kind of thing. But they're really fortunate to have this and we are going to show you around and show you some of the animals. Great. So as you probably know, everything's bigger in Texas. Today, we saw some beautiful animals. Some of them, a lot of them came out, some of them didn't. And Texas is one of the only, if not the only states that allows a lot of the exotics to come. Like if you were in other places, they wouldn't allow that. In fact, some of them, um, your husband, Blake, was telling me that the black buck is actually from India, brought it to Texas, and they've done so well here that they're actually now sending them back to India Yes, to um, help with their populations there because they've declined some, so and they do beautifully here. So it's it's neat that we can have the back and forth with the countries like that. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you have a really happy holiday with your family and we will see you next time. Mm -hmm.